What's up guys, here in another video. Today, I have a dual con with Asian. Hello. On the Naruto episode 337. Now, this episode, we got the, you know, Izamiya and how what, what it does. We got to see a recap of last episode, which was basically just Habuto in the cave with Orochimaru experimenting on everybody and then him with his mother and everything. So, that part was kind of a, uh, wasn't needed. Because we already saw the episode, so there's no reason to actually recap it. So I don't really get that. You got opinions on it? Yeah, I mean, it's always good to recap the previous episode. But, like, overall, that vi that episode was actually pretty good on the recapping and the flashbacks. It wasn't overdone. It was, like, evenly distributed. So it was pretty enjoyable to watch. I don't know what you're talking about there. <laughs> no, but still, it wasn't... Uh, like, I don't, I don't like having episode time and wasted by recaps so that's what i don't like about recaps well that is true but i also did like the fact that they're bringing back the old like members of like the soundcloud or whatever not the soundcloud jesus christ the sound clan or whatever the village yeah yeah it was cool like how he like um put them out of the chest and everything yeah they would use their juices and that was pretty cool yeah it was a bit weird that uh orochimaru was kind of Coming out of his stomach, oh my God. In that, in, especially in that form, like I'm that was the weird. Pedophile coming out of his stomach, wow, it, that's oh God. In my, that's in my, <laughs> my two favorite parts of the episode was when they both did the Masuramu at that um that spider web. And oh also yeah, yeah, yeah. Whenever they did it too, when they put themselves into a genjutsu and, and like and cut the both, snakes off of them. Yeah, that that was. Interesting. I didn't expect that to come, considering you watch the manga and or you read it and I don't. So like that's completely unexpected from me. <laughs> um, for me, I skipped around the manga a lot because I don't really know. It just got boring. But actually seeing it animated, it was a lot better. Even though the animations weren't amazing, but the, it was pretty watchable and I did enjoy it a lot though. Yeah. To be honest, I thought it was dumb at first. I was like, what the hell? It's just replaying a bunch of parts. And then I realized that he said it's like a deja vu. And then yeah. that like all clicked in my head. And I was like, oh, I, I get it. That's the point of this jutsu. Yeah, and then like, um, so this jutsu is basically just, it puts you in an infinite loop. And then um, it's kind of like, if you think back to um, how Ngeku and Kinkaku's like, thing works, where you have a, a word. Well, the Inzamiya is kind of like that, but you got to basically try not to um no i explain it but no it's like the it, is okay, it like, or whatever it is i, I can't yeah. pronounce it i don't remember the word but um it's like that but instead of you choosing your own fate you choose someone else's yeah and then like um so kabuto was like that he is orochimaru but he tachi was like no you are kabuto you're yourself you can't be Orochimaru, because Orochimaru is Orochimaru and you're Kabuto. So that's Tachi's whole point on that, and that's what we're trying to get him to, you know, um, realize. Yeah, I'm still surprised the fact that Itachi is still doing what he did even when he was alive. Like, just, I guess it's kind of nostalgic seeing that he's working with his brother now, and his brother knows everything of what he's done in the past. And I, it seems like he's just trying to fix everything right now. Yeah, so I think he's doing a good thing, actually working with Sasuke on this, actually, you know, teaming up together. And I did like how they did this scene perfectly by, like, you know, try, making Kabuto try to get out of it as many ways as he can. He even tried running away, and then, like, oh no matter what he did, he <laughs> got back in the loop. <laughs> that was hilarious. He, like, his horn kept getting, like, getting cut off, like, what, four times? Was, and all yeah. you see is the horns on the floors. <laughs> <laughs> that was hilarious. And then, like at the la at the in the you know, last part of the episode, what I did not like again, why they put the Jinjuriki song in there again? We already saw it like three times. And yeah, it's episode. not even involving them right now. Exactly, like, it's like it's just there. They ran out of like they ran out of time or ran out of like stuff to put in the video. So they're like, hey, you gonna put this Jinjuriki song? To waste yeah, and that more time. Like five minutes. <laughs> yeah, so this episode was really, really good, and then it actually 
you know, the battle is over. I felt like the battle could have lasted a bit longer. Like, no, isn't it still continuing, kind of? Like, you know, Kabuto's brain fucked. He just, he, he's, he's done. Oh, because, uh, like, I, I thought in the preview, at the end, it said that, um, it, the next, it tells the fate of the, or not the fate, but the history of the Uchiha's. And I believe it also said something about, like, Kabuto escaping. I, I can't quite remember since I did watch it a couple hours ago. But, because, like, yeah, there's a weakness to every jutsu. So there has to be a way that he figures out how to get out of it eventually. I don't want to spoil, but, you know, it's like, um, next week's episode is basically a filler not really a filler but kind of like a just a, another episode week. explaining like, yeah yeah the differences stuff. between those two so that's yeah so it's kind of a filler episode so we'll have to see what happens in the next episode and yeah yeah did we cover everything that we really needed to yeah did? so overall i get this episode a 8.5 I give it a 9.5 out of 10, alright? <laughs> it, it, I like this. I like the fact that it didn't give too many flashbacks. Like, the recent episodes have been given, like, they've been given way too many flashbacks. Yeah. And this one is just like 2 3, it's good. Fighting, that's, that's done and over. And then a little recap of other things, and it incorporated the old people, like, the older people. So I found that very interesting, and I liked the way that this episode was made. Yeah, me too. And yeah, hopefully we'll see some better animation. I don't want to like bash the animation, but it wasn't really um, great, but it was decent. Definitely and more hard. action. Like, it, yeah, it was a bit. That jutsu is just a bit too much with your mind. Like you had to think it through way too many times. Yeah. That's why they call the freaking Uchiha's basically Jutsu's brain fucking because Itachi's just it's just everywhere. The crows are so confusing and it's just it's just there. Yes, I did find that. Like I got confused myself, but then again I wasn't fully paying attention. But it was still good. Yeah, but so hopefully Kabuto will freaking acknowledge him as himself instead of trying to break the Genjutsu. Even though he's like, he even tried beating the Genjutsu with the Genjutsu, which was like a fail. Yeah, he tried taking their idea, that didn't work out so well. <laughs> so, thank you guys for watching. Thanks for Asian Ways for being here. And I'll see you guys next time. Peace.